I left uh, uh, Fox in 70. Uh, I went, I was asked by uh, another Texan, Herb Steinberg, Herb Steinberg, not Herb Steinberg. He was the head of Universal. Uh, it's a similar name. Mm -hmm. And Jennings Lang, the agent, to do a show uh, that um, Dennis Weaver ultimately did. And I could have segued from one television show to another, and I just didn't want to do it. I was still saying I want to do pictures. I'll do television, but I, I want to have a healthy career. So I signed a three-year contract with uh, Warner Brothers, and this is a this is kind of funny. You know, things happen at studios, politics, changing of position. So I had a, uh, a dressing room that's about four times the size of this room. I had a limousine. All I had to do was call for a limousine. I wanted to fly into, into uh, Burbank and go to a business meeting, studio, send a limousine. Uh, a couple of years went by, and one day we had a meeting of the head, the head of television and all the people involved in, in a room they called the Green Room. That was, the, that was where the deals were Consummated. Warner Brothers was a beautiful studio in those days. Uh, so we go down and we're having lunch, and it's a very, very convivial lunch. It's been billed as they have a great idea for me. And um, I said, okay, what, what's the idea? It came down to this. We would like for you to play a modern-day modern day sheriff in Arizona. Ah! I said, that's it? They said, that's it. Aren't you excited? I said, well, not really. I said, I, I have a friend that played that about 10 years ago. His name was Broderick Crawford. And, you know, I know another friend that did a similar one. You know, I said, I, don't, I really don't want to do that. Well, well, gosh, we're, you know, we're just disappointed. Well, they're, then, you know, they're paying me all this time, so. I'm not hanging around the studio. I'm doing my other things, and uh, so finally, the last segment of uh, of my contract came up, and there was a pretty good chunk of money involved, and so I thought, well, I'll I'll do something. I don't want to uh, just let that money go. So we had a, a meeting, and I, I said, okay, I'll play a sheriff, but you have to let me create the the, the the um, setting, and so what I what we did in that was, I, I tried to create the character who was a reluctant sheriff. He was really a rancher. He really wanted to just be work the cattle, but he couldn't afford to buy the ranch and ranch. He had to have a part time job, which was the sh sheriff's job. And I'd water skied for about ten years up on Lake Shasta, so I knew that country very well. And so. We collaborated on this, uh, and we made that film, and uh, no one wanted the film for whatever reasons, and so it, at that point, I, I had had the film business, and, and while it was in my thoughts and it shaped a lot of my thinking, I just was happy being my own boss.